There you go, we can record this. It was this long drop without any water for really, I don't know how long. And they managed to quite nicely preserve this garden. Uh, mother already claimed me this morning that there is no shit. But it doesn't appear to me like this. Claimed that my father was taking care of the garden. But it doesn't appear to me because it's 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 full of fruit all over the place. It's actually the food that is rotting. What's what is tempting me actually to grab the basket, fill one with a fruit and take this to the neighbors because they would appreciate I think. I think they would be happy to to get some of this. I like fruit, but the thing about it is that what can I say? It does have limits. You know, I don't think that I don't know how much of the fruits are also not too good. I like it, I enjoy it. Uh, I did the work not for myself. I did that like uh, like a charity option, uh, something that I helped basically uh, with a garden because father is inside of the hospital. But it appears that father is for completely other reasons inside of the hospital. I don't think we have had as much as this yet. Like I said, we can expect maybe for tomorrow to have a rain, maybe, uh, and it's probably God knows how long you would have to wait for the rain before you would get any drops. Yeah. I know she's not doing shit. I know she is just doing a trouble because of this stuff that I see, for instance. And it's not only this one. It's also this here, this one. And it's this kind of stuff that's not good stuff. She does not have to bring the water. I don't want her to bring the water. I want her to have as good life as possible. I distribute to the trees between three to 4,000 liters of water uh, every night, every evening. That's basically what I do to make her life easy. Uh, now the thing about it is that she could, if just she wanted to, inspect and do what I demonstrated you right now. But the thing about it is she doesn't. She likes to bitch. She's bitching. Uh, because psychiatrists for me to be completely clear about this issue, insisted me on how if I will not water the garden, uh, it's all gonna be my fault, it's all gonna go to hell, the garden, based on this and how it's gonna be my sanity that's gonna be and it was all this stuff, all this package was included. Literally, I'm telling you. She does this here. She does this kind of gardening. That's, that's what she does. I don't do any of that. And thanks God, she's using water hoses and stuff like this. If she would tell me to do this, I gladly would have done that too. 
Uh, it was all included, this gardening stuff was all included in a father's stay inside of the hospital. That's how the psychiatrists designed this stuff. And that shit was incorporated basically in varicose vein problem. Because my mother went ahead and repeatedly tied me shoes prior to departure to father. To whom I was next to doing my stuff, rush on foot so I would get exercise and instead of that because I didn't I didn't pay attention to I injured myself so this shit was all included it was all incorporated it was all it was all if you and then if you will not you it will be this we till just now now the song changed and the name of the song now is well she worries about paying the bill for the water pump because the water is sucked from from the river from right from there from the river below that's a big ass river uh and because there's no excuse left this is already a second uh grow of strawberries i didn't even anticipate it would be any i don't think that that there was there ever was two seasons in one season that we had but i water this exceptionally well and i think that might be the reason This here is from my sister that you see right here. These are blueberries. It was my sister that bagged me during MK Ultra. Please, please water my plants. Uh, if you will not water the plants, they will go to hell. You know, on this side here that you see always was like this, no matter what. It's how always this part here turned like this always 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 so already during mk ultra she demonstrated me and even asked me not to tear this off because it could cause a problem to them she was giving me little instructions bagging me basically these are siberian blueberries i think it's the name in english now the main plan behind this uh, psychiatric uh, brainwash on how I have to water this stuff was concentrated on two locations one location was the house right there that you see there's the guy that continually complain that in MK Ultra about the noise and the second would be the house right there where eventually a reservoir right next to one for the water reservoir is located but I don't see anything any catastrophes anywhere that anything that would demonstrate that I would be wasting water that I was doing anything wrong with it uh, but quite contrary to it I see plenty of fruit everywhere you know This is a fig, for instance. I watered one twice a night. And look what is this. 
the plants sure know how to appreciate goodies. So it appears not only as my niece have stated me that the plants would probably go to hell because they wouldn't come from the city. It was like, except for that year. And I asked Amaram Kyotra, what year? Oh, and they didn't want to say anything about this year. This is the year when they don't actually want to come around. Because the truth finally surfaced about who, what. It's not exactly the pleasant to them to interact. And so they bagged me for this year. Oh, this is basically where I get the water at night. And that was the fear that I would cause uh, a chaos at night time and so on. This people here, they would not cause me a trouble. This people would not cause me a trouble, but the man over there was connected and is connected to the uh, chief of the police, Yana Zogulin, who is completely, completely desperate, destitute, doesn't know what the fuck he want to do. Then you have a second neighbor right there. That's that burger right there, residency. These are the people that actually insisted me even they started to exercise the pressure on this neighbor here. On their residence, they started to harass them, claiming them that it's all going to be video recorded. And if I would be making noise, even next to their house, they would have to report me. So in other words, they have extorted some neighbors uh into cooperation uh like basically if it's gonna be chance to fuck me you have to report him at night time uh so the inspector can come and get him that he's violating peace at night and this and that but the inspector was pretty cool and the inspector told me i met the man the inspector he told me um it was also a problem here with this house it was something they told them uh you're gonna have to move back to apartment building and to the other neighbor right there across the street they told him well they told him my friend uh do you hear cars is it exceeding the noise you know those are the kind of a questions that are gonna be uh just close the window basically go fucking sleep inspectors alone told me they gave me a green light they said sebastian don't worry just do it we are not gonna meddle basically this was this was this was the <laughs> from the inspectors alone they told me during mk ultra don't even pay any attention to that just go for it no i always did keep quiet I didn't want to disturb people at night uh, the thing about it is that uh, you know you want people to sleep you don't want to cause any kind of inconveniences at night and this and that but you know just saying mother is gonna have a very hard job uh, proving that Oh, look at this. Look at this shit here. This is, uh, this is how she entangled and twisted uh, a tube, uh, the water hose, around this area because she knew that I was using, you see that uh, portable, I don't know how you say that. Let me demonstrate to you this. Since I'm not doing this stuff no more. Oh, that's like 17 liters, basically. Oh, now I'm gonna demonstrate to you how I did this stuff. Very, very awkward stuff to do. Uh, let me demonstrate uh, to you a few things. 
here's where I have a varicose vein problems, severe vein problems, for which they told me that I might develop chronic problem, not going to even be able to do much to walk. Uh, the second thing on the same side, therefore on the left side, I also have a problem. Actually, I don't have on the left side, on this side, I don't have a problem with the spine. The problem, however, is located on this side. So I used to learn, I did the, the gardening every time that I took with the left hand, um, you know, this thing, whatever you want to. In Slovenian language, Kongla. I balance myself weight always on this side so that I would not have a, a problem with the spine you know if you go just here and you're just using this one for support and you always put the weight here right but once my mother did to me with uh, shoelaces that shit that no longer became an option I realized uh, and I had to stop that. Now I had a problem because this side you can't do much because you have a problem with the spine. And that one you have a problem with variosis with the veins. So how you do the shit like this? Basically how the shit was watered the garden. How the hell this shit was done? Well, with a lot of pain, but it was done. Uh, one, two, three, four, full of water and this here filled with the water and carried from the tree to tree, from the tree to tree, basically. That's how. And for the reward, she would do shit like this. She would do the stuff like this so that you would have a problem and you would spill the water. And maybe the best thing she did what I really was impressed about it, and they did this, they demonstrated me on the MK Ultra, they're going to do it. She pulled this, and she pulled this, like that. Just like they promised me they would. And so, it's already healed now. But this was cut here, completely. I did go like this, with the hands were wet, work all night. And I really cut myself badly. It was like this, deliberately done. The one who promised me this procedure is going to be, it's going to be a police officer. Uh, but I doubt it. That was actually anyone that came and did this other than my mother. And I'm saying this because this shit that you see here, these water hoses, have been like this already for a week. See, I didn't go angry, I didn't go crazy about it. I just let it stand like this. I, let, I, let, I just let this... You see this thing here in particular? This to twangle? I just let it sit here. I just want to get the proof about that stuff right there, right? That's how it works. If you're gonna, if you're gonna fucking insist on this stuff here, with a predisposition of watering this thing all the time ongoingly, then obviously that you're behind that stuff too. So that's my mom. She thinks that, oh, you know, how, who, you know, well, it's not so difficult to point out who and how and this and that. The truth, however, is that in this shit, they had involved anywhere from police, Police would always participate and observe, ask questions, because police is familiarized with the law. They would also have prosecutors involved in this stuff that would participate. Some of which would even come from Ljubljana. We're talking about the state prosecutors.
And then they will have uh, people involved in it, anywhere from psychiatrists, people that interacted with me, that if you would go and you would start to claim stuff like this, you would be deemed as insane. And that was the goal. I don't actually know what the goal was. There is no more goal now because I identified so many people, but if I wouldn't, uh, just coming out and stating something like this could uh, kill you. You could spend the rest of your life somewhere in some psychiatric department. There certainly was no good intentions involved in it. Because when I did mention MKUltra torture, In as early as 2012, the only thing that happened was they threw me inside of the psychiatric hospital. In 2014, before her departure, psychiatrist Proxel, who was involved in this, since her high school, threatened me with just, with a new hospitalization if I would only dare to mention, if I would only dare to mention, listen to this shit, if I would only dare to mention the word known as MKUltra. I did, and the only thing that happened was banging on the doors of my room, and it was an ambulance vehicle that waited me outside, and they threw me inside, and it was it. She complained funny during the COVID issue. She complained. I have no idea who did this. She complained to me about how uh, does not have a fruit and I can see it's rottening this. This is ready. She should eat them. She claimed that I froze all the fruit and stuff like this, that that's what the fuck I did. So she wouldn't get the fresh fruit from the trees and stuff like this. This is a pure lunacy. What you have seen, the fruit, is just whatever is left. The fridge is already packed with the peaches. The majority of the peaches already was uh, taken. You have just seen a fraction of it, and there's also a jam she had made. So what you have seen so far, you have nothing, you, you don't see anything on this tree, and you have not seen on other trees because she already made jam and stored peaches inside of the fridge and all kinds of stuff like this, right? So that's why, but from what you can see, this is very healthy. I don't see anything wrong with the trees. I see more fruit than I ever did before in my lifetime. And you can trust me, I don't know if I have eaten... Definitely did not eat two kilos of fruits from this garden. You know, two kilos is shit. This is not much at all. Uh, probably a kilo, I would say. Uh, but even so, I greatly disturb her with my presence around, with work I do. And that's basically because... She used against me because I wouldn't go and cut the grass with the grass cutter. This is a really easy thing to do. When compared to the stuff I do. The stuff that I do is a really physical, shitty stuff. Especially under circumstances, I explained. Uh, but a reason enough for her to complain, 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 basically. Oh. I don't think I have anything else to say. <laughs>